uh, hi guys my name is Narayan and I welcome all of you in this video once again and before going further I would like to introduce you about my channel so I have a YouTube channel uh, which is uh, uh, totally based on CCN and, and MCITP uh, which is Microsoft technology and Cisco Technolo technology if my videos are helpful for you and, and informative you can uh, subscribe my channel by just typing my name Narayan uh, Baghel on YouTube so my channel will come on the top as you can see here you just need to uh, um, click here and subscribe uh, as of now I have uploaded 247 videos and for more, for, for more videos you can just subscribe and get from there and uh, in this video today I'm just gonna share about the ISIS intermediate system to intermediate system pa uh, packet types uh, the basic thing about all uh, uh, packet types so we talk about this one uh, basically IS, IS defines two category of network devices so basically it defines uh, two category of network devices first one is ES which is end system and second one is IS which is intermediate system what what is the role of this end system and what is the role of intermediate system here so the first one ES which is end system it identifies an end host where the data has to go and host uh, the identification of end host will be done by ES end system or uh, it is known as uh, end system and IS intermediate system identifies a layer 3 router so the, the role of uh, this system or you can say the work of this uh, intermediate system is to just identify a layer 3 router so this is uh, what we have two category of network devices here now IS IS additionally defines four category of packet types so now we will see uh, four category of packet types here so the first one is hello packet second one is LSA LSP and third one is CSNP and fourth one is PSNP so we will see all uh, four uh, packet types here by uh, one by one so first of all I will talk about uh, hello packet what does uh, here actually so first one is hello packet hello packets are exchanged for never discovery so the, the functionality the main functionality of uh, hello packet is to just uh, 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 exchange for the network discovery it, it helps to discover uh, neighbors and uh, three types of ISIS hello packets exist so there are uh, three types of hello packets here first one is IIH which is uh, known as ISIS hello second one is ESH ESH end system hello and third one is ISH which is uh, IS hello uh, intermediate system hello so if we talk about this IIH or uh, SISI ISIS uh, hello this exchanged between routers or IS to form neighbor adjacency the main function of this IIH or ISIS hello is to just uh, exchange the information to form a adjacencies now if we talk about ES hello sent from ES ES what uh, end system to discover routers so if uh, this is uh, happening or this this uh, hello packet is running on the network so the role of this uh, packet is to just discover routers uh, so it will be sent by uh, this packet will be sent by uh, end system if we talk about this is my end system and here I have a router so this uh, ESH will be sent from this to uh, discover this router on the network and third one is IS which is intermediate system hello sent from IS to announce its presence to ES so uh, after uh, after discovering that router uh, it will be sent by IS which is our uh, uh, intermediate system to announce its presence to ES so it will send this uh, information to ES which is our end, uh, end system yes this router exists and this is the information of this router so this is how uh, hello packets work here now we, we will talk about the third third uh, second packet second packet is link state packet which is also known as LSP uh, if we talk about this N 
LSP is used to share topology information between routers. So if we have uh, multiple topologies uh, uh, in network, so it will share th that information with the uh, routers within the routers between routers or uh, that infrastructure, whatever we have. And the third one is like uh, a CSNP, which is known as complete sequence number PDU is an update co uh, containing that full link state database so it will contain full link database is out is routers will uh, refresh the full database every 15 minutes so this uh, refreshment of uh, database will happen after every 15 minutes if you are appearing an exam so this is a very important question we should be aware about this one what is the time for uh, is to refresh is its database the fourth one uh, is like uh, a PSNA, which is known as partial sequence uh, number PDU is used by ISIS routers to both request and acknowledge a link state update. So this PSNP is used to, you know, exchange the information uh, like request and acknowledgement of link state update. So in this video guys this much only I hope this video will be informative for you if it is informative for uh, for you guys please uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel don't forget to like this video comment and uh, share so that it may reach to the other, other guys also and uh, wait for my next video till then bye bye.